thank you. Well, the San Benito Police Department will hold a candlelight vigil and one mile walk next Friday to honor and remember Lieutenant Milton Resendez. It's happening at Heaven Memorial Park's Amphitheater at 6.30 p.m. And you're invited. The department will provide glow sticks and other lighting materials to use during the ceremony. Well, a historical marker is now on display at St. Joseph Academy over in Brownsville. The school's class of 1964 worked together with the Texas Historical Society to make this happen. The marker honors the Maris Brothers who have run St. Joseph Academy since 1906. The Maris Brothers have provided Catholic education for students in the Valley and Matamoros. The president of the school had this to say about the marker's significance. This wall here I was part of the original campus from back in 1865, and it's the lone remaining piece of the campus from that time. Motel went on to say the marker is a symbol of the school's deep roots in the community. Well, if you happen to be an art lover, then you'll definitely appreciate one event that Danielle's eager to share with us, and it's all about creativity, right, Danielle? Right, Adam. <laughs> hey, Adam, aren't you excited about this art walk? Yes. Okay, good. <laughs> Just had to make sure before I tell you about it. But okay. you know what, Adam the McCallion Creative Incubator Team uh, is going to be hosting a really fun art walk, <laughs> and it's expected to really open up the world of creativity indeed. Just, you know, inspire us all with visual talents. There are going to be different vendors, exhibits, and live musical entertainment on site. Plus, it is a family-friendly event, so the kiddos are surely going to enjoy all the sites. There are going to be various features of the venue to check out, and get this, it is free to the public. So <laughs> there's no fee, there's no registration required. That's pretty cool. Just drop on by, have fun. It's all going to be happening today and it's going to be going down uh, from 6 to 9 in the evening. So you're going to be able to check out hands-on activities, unique artwork by national names, but also local artists and even join in on some local art groups too. I mean, they meet up regularly to study art and even create it. Attendees are going to have the chance to uh, support local art scenes and, and people in that scene. And just be sure to visit Valley Business Report com if you do want to know everything you're gonna need to know to attend this art walk guys like my pun at the beginning